Okay, so here's another game. Um, I landed lonely, as usual, and uh, I saw a tree disappear over this way somewhere. So uh, I'm trying to get behind this cover as quick as I can while keep check while I keep checking behind me. And uh, I'm not exactly sure where this guy's at right now. All right, so I hear his gun cock, and now I see him. So uh, he's building up on me, which is fine. And I get shot. I'm sorry. I'm gonna get shot in the back here in a second. So there it goes. So I have to make a move. And uh, so now this next guy is coming at me. And uh, yeah, so he's got a rocket launcher. I'm just gonna try and build, and I'm gonna try and heal as fast as I can. Uh, yeah, so as you saw, I wasn't at the greatest health, but um, the guy had minis, and uh, he has a pump. So I'm gonna take the pump, because it's blue, and it's better than a gray LR. I'm gonna try to outbuild, but... I'm just gonna get the clean headshot off. I missed the first shot, but I made up for it with a strong second shot. And, uh, I mean, this guy had every gun that I could possibly want. I mean, he had a scar, minis, med pack, rocket launcher, golden sniper, he even had a grenade launcher. I mean, this guy was running double rockets. Like, he was set. And, uh, yeah. That's a quick one, two. Uh, Obviously, I I prefer my kills to be a little more spread out and a little less hectic, but that's all right. I mean, I finished strong, and uh, I got the two kills, and I, it put me in such a good position for the rest of this game. I mean, we're almost top 15. We've got a good gun layout. We're not doing the greatest on health, obviously, and we're not doing the greatest on uh, meds. I think I only have three minis right now. It's either one or three. And, uh, you know, I, I would really like to take those med packs as well, but um, I'm assuming that the as long as I have good guns, that the next person I kill will have meds. And, uh, yeah, that's just what I'm relying on. I, I'd rather have the gun set up right now. You know, I'd rather have the AR for mid-range, the shotgun for up close, the rocket launcher for damage and surprise attacks, and then the sniper for long range, right? I mean... I don't want to give up any of those aspects just banking on me needing a med pack which uh i think is the right call um yeah could bite me in the ass but i mean if it does the next game i'll take the med pack over something and you know you just kind of play it out that way i find and uh, you know, I'm playing a little bit more confident this game. This is my, uh, I've got two wins before this, so I'm not all worried about winning or losing because I've already got wins today, so, you know, it doesn't really matter to me at this point. And, uh, I actually won, uh, in the... Uh, a no kill, no shots fired at somebody, no no nothing, smallest circle victory today. And uh, it's the first time I've been able to actually do that, and it's hilarious. Uh, that video will be on at some point as well, so probably it's already on. But seeing as well, I'll probably make that video before this one. But, uh, yeah, <laughs> if you haven't seen it, it's definitely worth a watch. It's pretty funny, but yeah, I'm just, you know, trying to get the zone, trying to see who I can find. I saw a port of forward up here, so I assume somebody's going to be there, but uh, that's not really the fight that I want to take. And uh, as you can see, there's somebody attacking the port of forward already, which uh, that's just a bad time. Taking on a port of forward is bad enough as it is. But when somebody else is attacking it, you've got no position of power. 
there's somebody up top and there's somebody down low, which means there's nowhere for you to run. And uh, I debate going to it right there because I'm like, oh, who cares if I die? But then I think, well, no, you know, I want to finish strong and uh, I don't want to die just by being reckless. So um, I see Shifty Shafts is still in play and uh, I figure that's a good place to kind of run, see if there's anything there that I can take and uh, hopefully find a big pod maybe. I'm hoping that it's unlooted because you know sometimes towns just get skipped and uh, it's always worth the look. But yeah, so we're top 10 now. Uh, looks like there is somebody in Shifty. So it'll be interesting. He's got the heavy shotgun out, full health. And uh, yeah, hopefully I don't run into him. But I'm just gonna go and I'm gonna check all like the hidden loot spawns, like the ones that are behind the walls like this. Just because those ones sometimes get missed even if this place has been looted. And uh, yeah. All right, so I hear footsteps behind me. So I'm gonna get the rocket launcher out and I'm gonna get behind cover. And uh, I fire the first shot, I hit him. And I come up and I finish with the second shot. And what do you know? The guy had a big pod for me. Uh, and he had more minis, more rockets. You know. Everything that I want. So uh, I'm going to keep the blue pump over the, uh, the heavy shotgun. Primarily because the, the blue pump can one-shot a guy on full health. Which, I mean, if you're losing a fight and you get that one clean headshot off, there's the fight gone, right? Like, its winning capability is just incredible. So um, I actually heard that, uh, you see that character right there? I actually heard him. He was going to come down at first, but I think he heard the rockets and decided that that was a poor choice. But obviously, I don't know that. So I'm assuming that he's still going to run up this way. So uh, I'm going to be waiting for this drop to land as well as I'm just going to focus on this area because I know that there's a player there. And I'm going to keep checking behind me as well. But uh, this was my main air, uh, area of concern. Just because I, I did hear that guy jump down originally. And uh, I'm just going to wait to see if he was waiting up top and see if he would go for it first. And uh, it's a chug jug. So I'm going to give up my minis for the chug jug. Primarily because I'm only running one form of meds. So uh, I really think that the chug jug, I know I can't use it mid fight, but uh, I can recover from any fight. Even if I have one health, I can get back up to perfect health. All I have to do is survive. And I've got a rocket launcher, which deals high damage. So my likelihood of surviving my fight after this and using the chug jug and then taking that person's minis are high and uh, uh, I saw somebody up there and I kind of panicked and uh, I immediately wanted to put up a one by one but as you can tell I'm not actually in the zone and uh, right now I uh, I noticed that <laughs> I'm not in the zone and I, uh, I just wasted like 300 materials so uh, yeah you know, I have to chop down a tree because I am running low, which isn't great, but you know, you got to do what you got to do. So uh, that guy takes a shot at me and uh, I'm just going to get a bit higher so he doesn't have as good of sight as well as turning my stairs. So that way I can be fully hidden behind this wall and uh, make sure that he can't get any kind of sneaky headshot off on me. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty bad at reading the map sometimes and I actually thought that this guy had to move. <laughs> That's why I'm focusing on him so much. 
I'm like, oh, this guy's gonna have to move. He's gonna have to come to me. And uh, right here, I get attacked. So there's one, and uh, we're just gonna teach this guy a lesson. So uh, he was trying to build to defend. Uh, that guy's trying to, you know, get into the fight now. But uh, he was trying to build to defend, but as you saw, he left that little corner open. And uh, I just snuck a rocket right in that little corner. I tried doing it the first time he built up, but I missed. And uh, I obviously hit the, the edge of the thing, which saved him. But I got it in the second shot, and uh, he was dead because of it. So, yeah. As you can see, the guy on the hill is being snuck up on right now. And, uh, yeah. I'm going to use this opportunity uh, to try and get the mass off that guy. So as soon as they pop off, I'm going to run and get the mass. I'm going to put up a couple walls just because. And uh, I didn't take any damage, obviously, from that, that last fight. So um, I'm not going to switch out the chug jug for minis or anything like that. But... Um, as you can tell, the, the sniper's gone now, and um, uh, you can see that guy fly padding away, uh, obviously trying to get high ground in the next zone. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the same. Uh, there's only four other people left. I see about three of them fighting right there. Uh, now there's only two other people left. And uh, I figured I was going to do a direct assault, but I figure I'll go for high ground and use the ramps that are already here. So uh, I think this was the right play. Uh, it gives me high ground with a rocket launcher, and now it's the final two. Obviously, I don't know it's the final two yet, but... Uh, so I see the last guy, and uh, he luckily moves. So I took a bit of damage there. I took 100 damage to myself. Uh, I was trying to sneak the rocket under and uh, get a cheeky kill on him that way. It obviously didn't work, but uh, if that would have worked, it would have been awesome. <laughs> uh, so yeah, we're sitting at four kills. Uh, we've got a rocket launcher. We've got full health. Uh, you know, we've got everything that we need except for height right now. Uh, I could definitely use a bit of height. Uh, I just picked up those minis, so don't think I ran by them. And uh, we're just going to get height as fast as possible. So uh, I'm not even putting a, a floor in between my stairs right now. Uh, at least not all of them. But uh, I figured this is a good height to get to because I can connect my tower. As you see right here, I can connect it to multiple spots. Which uh, makes knocking my tower so much harder to do. Because honestly right now I'm figuring that the last guy is going to have a sniper, he's going to have a rocket launcher, and obviously everything that he needs to kill me is what it, it's just the safest thing to assume. So uh, I'm just going to try and track this guy. I don't know where he is, and uh, that's kind of stressing me out. I'm going to put up a couple escape plans, uh, just in case. And... Uh, Obviously, he was down there, but I didn't know that. Otherwise, I would have been blasting that thing with uh, rockets. So, um, I see a base over there, and I figure that's a good place to start checking before the zone kind of moves in. And, uh, I'm just looking to see if a roof gets rebuilt. And, uh, I heard him now. And down he goes. Uh, this guy was pretty impatient, I think. Uh, there was two big pods down there, and, uh, he could have got to full health and survived my rocket. I honestly don't know why he wouldn't have. Um, I guess, yeah, there's, there's just nothing more than just that he was impatient. Um, I don't know why he would come at me with, like, 105 health. Um when there's that much of like meds and shields and stuff available 
Um, it's a bad, bad move on his part. And uh, so yeah, I think uh, if he would have taken the time to met up, um, he might have stood, stood a better chance. I'm not sure whether or not me breaking the floor from under him would have killed him with fall damage afterwards. But, I mean, there was med packs down there too, or med kits down there too, so even if I shot him down, he could have just healed back up and came for another another chance, right? Like, yeah, he just, he screwed up by not taking the time to look around and assess assess the situation. And uh, I won because of it. A uh, five kill win, which isn't too bad. Um, it's better than the two kills that I've been getting in the past couple wins, but uh, this game I played a little more aggressive and uh, just wasn't as worried with the uh, outcome, which uh, usually helps. You're not overthinking things, you know. So, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, if you like what you saw, leave me a like, and if there's anything you think I could do better, kind of leave me a comment and tell me what you thought. Uh, subscribe if you like what you did see, and uh, check out some of my other videos. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, have a good day. <laughs>